An Orange County coronavirus survivor who's only seen the inside of a hospital for 45 days is finally able to go home. His family wasn't sure this day would ever come. Circle of Health reporter Denise Dore shares his uplifting story with us. Cheers of joy, mariachi music, and applause for 53-year-old Armando Mendoza's return home to his loved ones. Thank you, thank you. The husband and father of three hasn't seen his family for a month and a half. I'm so really happy. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus, for uh, giving me another opportunity. You know, uh, thank you. It's a hero's welcome, but Mendoza and his family say the real heroes are the doctors, nurses, and other staff at St. Joseph Hospital Orange who refuse to give up on him. Everybody who supported and assisted my dad, we're incredibly happy, we're incredibly blessed, and uh, we're just excited to have him home. You know, it, it's, been, it's been really hard. It's been really hard, and given the situation, given the circumstances, today's a magnificent day. Armando has a distinction of being the hospital's longest stay COVID-19 patient. He was extremely sick, and there were times when we were wondering uh, how he would pull through the night. He looks quite different from when he was first admitted on March 21st. Around 48 hours after he came in, he had to be placed on a breathing machine because he was not able to sustain his breathing. And after that, he was on the breathing machine for at least four weeks. Dr. Juby Babu and his staff went a step further, placing him on a special rotoprone bed to help turn his body. Proning is a technique of uh, helping the patient get better oxygen. And so that is being used on all patients who come in now, even if they are awake. Armando remains on oxygen, but he's doing quite well for someone who's received critical care treatment for so long. Doctors say he still has a long road ahead, but he's looking forward to being back home with his wife, Lilia. I'm so happy. Thank you, guys. Thank you for your support. Thank you. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.